What is the difference between connecting to a repeater or a hotspot? And okay, the difference is is that a repeater is going to be usually uh, with a high power antenna uh, and a big device for a lot of duty cycles. So a lot of people can connect to it. It's going to be mean, you know, made to process a lot of data, and it usually uses duplex time slots. So two two time slots. Hot plots, uh, hot spots, sorry, are usually set up as simplex modes or nodes, they call them. And they uh, go only with one frequency and one time slot. Um, they also are only 10 milliwatts, uh, I believe it is, of power. So they're very, very, very low power compared to the high power, you know, 50 watts or more that are pushed out from repeaters. So the repeaters cover a larger area. Hotspots are more centralized for your home or office or vehicle or something like that as, as opposed to a repeater. Now, I always tell everyone, get a hotspot. Uh, hotspots are amazing because at that point, you don't have to worry about fighting with someone on a repeater. We went over this yesterday and Dan asked me about that. I was trying to do a check-in with the net, one of the weekly end, uh, you know, nets on the, on the weekends. And I was having difficulty check, uh, checking in because every time I was trying to key up, other people were keying up and using it for other, frequent, uh, other talk groups. So it got really annoying and I couldn't even do my net check-in that week. And I, I really was bummed, but you know, it is what it is. So now I know I learned, you live in, you learn, and that's why I love and use my hotspot all the time.